emails are set to overtake stiffies. I'm talking. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> what are you? I thought you were a nice crowd. <laughs> I mean, the stiff invitation card. Oh, yes. Card, cardboard stiffy invitations, I meant, obviously. <laughs> All the gold embossed wedding invitations, that kind of thing, apparently are facing extinction. A fifth of couples now invite family and friends via email and social media. Mm, so, inbox rather than postbox now, it seems. Would you like getting a, a wedding invite by email? It's wrong. No, no. it's wrong. <laughs> need a, we need an invitation. I've got that. I've got the farty chair today. <laughs> <laughs> so, Andrea McLean, she's fobbed it down. <laughs> they, all use, they all use that excuse, Jane. Um, yeah. But the... the um, no, I, absolutely. I like, I've got about three invitations on my mantelpiece at the moment. And I like it. I like it. Mm. I think, oh, yeah, I've got that coming up. An email, no. And some people invite people to their wedding by text. Oh, my, I think that's To the awful. wedding? Are you sure? Yeah, well, that's yeah, what it says. It does say. <laughs> I noticed that a lot of the, um, like, big social occasions now come in by email. Mm. And I don't like that so much. I'm, I'm with, I'm with mm. Jane, actually. I do love a proper invitation. We're old-fashioned, aren't we? Yeah, we are old-fashioned. And I am the age I am, I know. Uh, <laughs> but, you know, I have an old invitation that actually came um, to do with the Princess Diana uh, event and I cannot throw that away. It's no. not exactly displayed in the mantelpiece. Mm -hmm. It's just tucked a little bit behind the mirror, <laughs> so that people take it out and go, "Ooh, Princess mm. Diana." It's, there is a bit of showing mm. off, isn't there? If you've got some fancy schmancy invitation, yeah. you can pop up somewhere. Yeah. And Jane's I, got say... three in her mantelpiece. <laughs> yeah. I've only got one. <laughs> I'm not say, from, I'm not, I don't think not... to do with the royal family, though. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you've had I'm, a royal one, though. Um, you? I have. I have. I've had. Um, I've had a, um, an invite for, uh, for St James's Palace and. After I went, which, you know, it was brilliant, um, I had it in my garage and my mum was absolutely furious. She was like, this has got to be mounted and she put it in a frame and all sorts. I'm, I don't know, I'm not offended by an email invitation. I think I'm just happy to be invited. Like, oh. I'd, be worried, <laughs> I'd be worried I'd forget it because I get a lot mm, of emails, most yeah. of them junk, and then I flag things. You know, I go, I must yeah. remember to do that, and yeah. then it kind of disappears. Yeah. Where an invitation, you know, A, I think it always looks very nice, but mm. then you sit it there somewhere, yeah. don't you, on your mantelpiece mm. or the kitchen or Definitely. wherever. And I also believe that the invitation kind of sets the, you know, the standard of what what's to come in the event and, and it also just gets you excited, especially if you can see it, but... But they you know. are very expensive and I have to say, I yeah. feel really mean when I've had a beautiful invitation. Some say they come in a proper little pack with directions and everything, mm. is that, you know, a couple of weeks after the wedding, I throw it away and as I'm throwing it away, I do think... Someone's paid a lot. Of you think money of the mortgage that. you spent on yours? Yes, yes. <laughs> and mine will be, you know, and they're so lovely. They I hate to think people throwing mine away. I'd like I to know. think they kept them as a souvenir, Gloria. <laughs> 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 it's good. good. <laughs>